Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Last year, Stoger introduced this gun here called the STR-9. It's a full-size handgun that performs very nicely. It's priced right and it has many positive features. Check out those slide cuts in the serrations. Very deep cut, does have the front serrations there. Nice ergonomic grip. A magazine that carries 15 rounds. Additional back straps are available. Polymer frame, striker fire handgun, three dot metal sights, a loaded chamber indicator bar, reversible magazine release, a pick rail. You know, it just has everything that many people would like. People were picking these up for right around 250 bucks. And I thought that was a steal. And um, I've owned it for every bit of a year now. I've got many rounds through it, it's performed great, and I really enjoy the pistol. But this year, just recently, Stoger introduced a smaller model called the STR-9C for compact. Now, this has a 4.17 inch barrel, this has a 3.8 inch barrel, and the grip is a little shorter as well. It has a magazine that carries 13 instead of 15 rounds, and the, this mag will work in this as well. But it's a nice handgun, it's much like its big brother, it's just a little bit smaller, and it has many of the same features, but a couple things have changed other than the size. But let me talk about the price. The MSRP here is $329 with the basic package. Now the, the basic package is one back strap, one magazine, $329. They also have Packages with three back straps, three magazines for a little bit more money, and then you can even get the premier package with the tritium night sights and three mags, three back straps, right around 450. So it's priced right. But the one thing that I've noticed, check out that slide finish, more of a matte finish, little shine there. Okay, that's one thing that's changed. Another is the checkering on the back strap much more aggressive right there you can feel that nothing wrong with this but when you grip this you can just feel that hit the uh you know the meaty part of the palm when you grip the gun i've enjoyed this i think i'm going to enjoy this just as much very ergonomic grip and with the magazine inserted three finger contact it does have those same slide serrations deep cut slide serrations three dot metal sights and a loaded chamber indicator bar just like the larger model the trigger i am measuring right at six you know most of the time six like between six and six and a quarter does have a trigger bar safety in there nice strong strike reset right there also has the pick rail but it's a good looking firearm and I, I know it's gonna fire excellent very accurate much like that You know, I keep saying that but that that's my reference right here Stoger does not make a lot of pistols and Currently these are the two that are in Production, but if you go with this you'll get this cardboard box with this fancy covering right there And the one thing I noticed is that this is also two ounces lighter, so let's check that out We'll just measure the the new model and you're going to trust me on that two ounces lighter bit one pound eight and a quarter ounces just ounces what i do there right there 24 and a quarter ounces but what i have here are 13 rounds it has a 13 round mag 29 and three quarters five eighths it can't make its mind up how about this there's 14 rounds and even 30 ounces so that that's pretty good and we'll take a look at the internals and then compare it with some other firearms that you may be familiar with so you can get a good size idea of what you're looking at well, what I do I don't think I pulled both tabs down there we go and there is your polymer frame I do like that grip it's very comfortable and the magazine releases reversible as well for lefties and a metal guide rod single spring and here's your 3.8 inch barrel all right very simple disassemble process and i really do look forward to this i i saw this 
not too long ago and I wanted to get on it right away. I don't see any other videos on YouTube with this gun. This may be the first one, I'm not sure. A couple, uh, couple website articles. But those guys, they, they write reviews sometimes when they never even really handle the gun. There's the big difference there. Here we're seeing every bit of it. But let's show the difference with the FNS 9C. All right, we'll look at the slide. A little bit longer with the STR 9C on the left. And then 12 rounds with the FNS and 13 right here with the STR 9. Okay. And over here we've got a Canic TP9 Elite Subcompact. Very close there. Slide length. And then the grip length. About the same. Right there. And then over here we've got the CZ P10S. And this one measures up almost identical. Check that out. And then a little longer, but I've got an extension there. And while we're at it, let's go ahead and do the or show the difference in size with the str9 okay about three quarters of an inch longer with the slide and about a half inch maybe a little longer with the grip but there it is the stoger str9c a new release and um i have to say i'm looking forward to it i can't wait to get this to the range i think it's going to perform just as well as the full size str9 and i'll certainly make a range review so you guys can check it out for yourselves if you like videos like this please subscribe and share i always appreciate the thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe